Music albums were on fire in 2022. With so many memorable projects taking over the Billboard 200, let's look back at how we arrived at the top 10 albums of the year. All right, Summer Walker started the annual race on top thanks to her sophomore album, Still Over It. Her first number one debut, then Taylor jumped in with that re-release. Brad Taylor's version took the lead with a nearly decade-old album, an incredible feat. But once Adele's 30 showed up, I was non-stop. It spent six weeks at number one on the Billboard 200, but girl consistently moved units throughout the year. Now, Red Taylor's version held onto that second spot for as long as she could all too well. The 10-minute version was definitely something that kept Swifty streaming. Summer Walker and Drake holding steady in the top five. And there's Morgan Wallen. Now it's time to talk about Encanto. Check out that soundtrack gaining on our top ladies. Come on, everybody was talking about Bruno. We don't talk about Bruno, but we do. No, 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 no. Disney's Encanto soundtrack is glued to that third place slot. The whole top three is not budging at all as we progress into the year. Watch out though for Morgan Wallen's Dangerous The Double Album. This was the top album of 2021 and still huge in 2022. And yep, it keeps gaining units. His fans are pushing him forward and there it is. It pushed ahead of the Encanto soundtrack. And wow, even ahead of Taylor. But no one's been able to surpass Adele yet. But check out who cracked the top five and keeps gaining. That's right, Bad Bunny with Un Verano Senti. Talk about an album that took over 2022. This was Bad Bunny's year. Check it out, it keeps rising. <laughs> Meanwhile, Harry's house from Harry Styles is making moves up. I can't get you off my mind. And whoa, it's official. We have a new leader and it's Benito. Bad Bunny officially dethrones Adele, moving the most units. And you can see the natural growth of the album pushing and pushing all the way to the top. He had an incredible tour and put up some incredible streaming numbers. But wait, it's Taylor with the last entry sprint into the top tier with Midnight. Check out Miss Swift with two of the top five albums of the year. Bad Bunny still ended 2022 on top. Hey, what a year in music.